So hello guys, today I will be going to show you and how to submit your modules. So first, uh, your teacher will give you a code and that code you'll be using that to join your classroom. Okay, so click this plus button here on the right side. So click that one and click join class and then from that code you just have to put it in here so guys for example our class code will be this one so on bsit4c the class code is agfi3x7 so you copy that one control c and then control v paste that one so you'll have to click now the join button so it says here you are joining so once naka join naka in that group uh, the google classroom will guide you for example this one share something with your class but you don't have to share if you don't like it create post share information question with question with your class just click get it okay class you notice that miss nana posted a new assignment okay the title is just in information technology so you'll have to click that one and then it says here that you have to add or create files for your classwork anything you add or create can be seen by your teacher so just click next if you don't need to add or, or create files you can mark your work as done okay then click get it so this is the instruction from your teacher it says here that in lesson one ages of information technology pre-assessment page two te for 10 points and so on and so forth then the deadline for this is on october 2 once na ma receive nyo itong PDF or gawain ninyo pwede na po ninyong i-click ito okay and then it will load like this so it's something like that okay you can print this one if you have your printer at home okay uh, by the way guys this tutorial is for those students na hindi pa alam kung paano mag-submit ng kanilang modules. So, this one is the the module, the soft copy of the module living in the ITR. So, we have here learning task, so on and so forth. So, from this learning task, guys, pwede po ninyo itong uh, ansiran. Pwede po ninyo i-print in this button here. Okay, now let's proceed on how to download this PDF file. Okay, this is our PDF file. So just click the three dots here on the right side. It says here more actions. Click that one, then open new window. So, mag open po siya ng another window on Google Drive. And then, notice the buttons here. So, this is the download button. So, click that and then, so, mag appear po itong IDM natin. Uh, for those na wala pa pong IDM, you can download IDM. So, ang bilis lang po. Then, open folder. So, by the way guys, itong tutorial na to ay para po sa mga studyante na hindi pa po alam kung paano i-download yung PDF file sa kanilang Google Classroom especially to my students out there Charat. so sa, sa lahat po ito ng mga sudyante na hindi, to, hindi ba po alam kung paano mag-download ng file so matapos nyo pong ansiran for example ang ginawa nyo ay uh, in a word okay, from this file okay, for example that file Ang gagawin po ninyo, i-add nyo yung work nyo. Okay? Add or click, add or create, and then choose file. Okay? Then, you will be asked to choose from this, recent upload my drive start. So, click upload. Then, 
it says here now you have to browse or to drag a file in here so since pwede naman i-drag i-drag na lang po natin ito dito so maglo-load po yung file na ginawa natin so guys pwede pong uh, pwede naman po na picture format okay pwede siya hindi naka word you take a photo on that answer Okay, on that file, and then you add it in here. So it, ser it says here that turn it in, meaning when you're ready to submit all your files for this assignment, remember to turn it in. You turn it in, meaning ibalik or submit nyo na work na ginawa. So I'll click got it, and then pagkulang pa po yung ginawa uh, yung word doc yo meaning may ililink pa po kayo na or i-upload pa po kayo na file click again a file and then upload then browse again click open and then mag-load again uh, at isasubmit ninyo pwede naman po word photo or picture so pwede din videos just click that upload file or upload button. Nasa sa inyo po kung saan po kayo mas comfortable. So, we have here the work. Okay. Okay, from this word and this PDF file. So, pwede pa rin kayo mag-add ng links and so on. Okay. Uh, after ninyong mag-upload ng inyong work, so, you just have to click this turn in. Okay? Turn in. Or submit nyo yung dalawang attachments. So, turn in your work. Two attachments will be submitted for ages of information technology. Then, just click turn in. So, notice malayo pa po yung due date. Okay? It's on October 2 pa po. Pero, ang aga-aga nating nagpapasa. I notice class na October 2 is the due date which is on Friday. Okay? Pag meron pa po kayo nakalimutan, pwede niyo po i-click yung unsubmit button. Unsubmit to add or change attachments. So don't forget to resubmit once you're done. Okay, unsubmit po tayo para para i-add po yung file na nakalimutan natin. I-add then click file again. By the way, guys, you can select more files. Okay. So in that image, for example, that is your answer. For example, ito lahat yung ating sagot sa sa task na ito. Ages of information technology. So you just have to click turn in. So guys, you can turn it in kung lahat na po ng attachment ay na i-upload nyo na. Okay. Once na uh, October 3 na po, for example guys, it's October 3 na and you forget to add something on this task. So, hindi na po ito ma-unsubmit. So, wala na pong button na unsubmit kasi it's done na po. Okay? Hindi na po siya madalagdagan kasi uh, it's on October 3 na. Okay? It's beyond the deadline. Okay. and for other queries guys you can comment below so that's all guys thank you for watching i hope na meron po kayong natutunan sa ating video na to bye bye